be in person name. What is your name? Officer Daza Ferrovic. Officer who? Daza Ferrovic from the 41. What's your and what's your badge number? And what? One two two three. And what's your nationality? Excuse me. What's I'm your American. nationality? You're American. Yes. How can you be American and you took an oath? Sir, why in the doohickey are you asking this officer what his nationality is? Once you get that information from him, how is that supposed to help you in this particular situation? Please stop it. That's a parole from the 411. What's your and um, what's your badge number two, and what? One two two three. And what's your nationality? Excuse me. What's I'm your American. nationality? You're American. Yes. How can you be American and you took an oath? Hmm. Boss. I'ma turn my car off. Thanks. Get your shift, Commander. Cause every time, every second that you have me here, I'm charging you a minute for the for the second. Okay. What? What in the doohickey are you talking about, sir? Every minute that he has you there, you're charging him a second for the minute or a minute for the second. It is apparent that this Morris Sovereign is just making things up on the fly. He has no idea what he is talking about. Get your shift, Commander. Because every time, every second that you have me here, I'm charging you a minute for the for the second. Okay. Get, get, your shift, sir. get your shift, Commander. All right, you got it. All I won't say anything else. Get your shift, Commander, please. I told you I'm driving. And right now, y'all trying to intimidate me to provide something I don't lawfully have to. I'm not driving, I'm traveling. Car stop and you car stop. I'm not driving, I'm traveling. Get your shift, Commander. I will not say another word. This Morris Sovereign obviously doesn't watch YouTube videos because there are abundance of videos out there showing other Morris Sovereigns making the same I'm not driving, I'm traveling argument and failing miserably. So he needs to get in touch with YouTube University because it is fully documented that the I'm not driving, I'm traveling argument is a losing argument. Long time sensor, show me on a car stop on Lafayette and Mineta. Every minute that you have me detained here, I will be charging you a dollar a minute. Gotcha. A dollar a second, actually. All right. Okay, so let's do some quick math. He said a dollar a second. So that's $60 a minute. Okay, so now that we figured out this more sovereign's fee schedule, it's pointless. Because I doubt he'll be getting any of that. Sir, you will not be charging them a dollar a second. You won't get anything, sir. What are you talking about? I wonder why it's, it is that none of these Morris Sovereign's fees that they try to charge these officers are all totally different. Every minute that you have me detained here... I will be charging you a dollar a minute. Gotcha. A dollar a second, actually. Sorry. Do not place your hands on my private vehicle. I know, but I still need your license. N I am not driving. I told you I am traveling. Well, you're operating a vehicle. I am not operating a vehicle. Well, I'm not a member of your society. I told you that. Get your shift commander, please. Because right now, you're trying to intimidate me to provide something right. that I don't have to provide. I am going to bring the shift commander in. Please do. I told you I'm an American national. I'm not a member of your society. Sergeant. You stopping me, giving me a courtesy, saying that my lights were off? Okay. I didn't know. I got lights on right now. I didn't know that. Well, now you know. I didn't know. I'm not driving. I just told you I'm not. I told you I'm not driving. I told you I'm traveling. And you keep saying that I'm driving. Right now, you're trying to intimidate me to provide something I don't legally have to provide. Driving. What's what is? Traveling. I'm traveling. That's correct. Okay, sir. Give us a second. What's right? your What's your name? 
Officer Ramirez. Officer Ramirez, yeah. what's your badge number? And, and, 69, sir. And what's your nationality? Thank you. I'm the Caribbean. The Caribbean, huh? So you can't bring your law over here then? Well, one, uh, Am I waiting for your shift, Commander? Uh, yep. Expressway. Yeah. So I'm being illegally detained by two officers, detectives. They're still trying to intimidate me to force some, to provide some type of identification. And I don't have to because I'm not a member of this society and I'm not driving. I got you, sir. And just to let you know, you're also being recorded as well, all right? Okay, that's cool. You too. This is my, this is my um, evidence. And this is my weapon. Just like you have a bunch of weapons and you're trying to intimidate me to provide I'm something. I'm trying to intimidate you. Bro. Yes, you are. Simply ask you for That's driver's license. I'm not driving. I told you that. I don't have a contract with the DMV. Please get your shift commander. He doesn't have a contract with the DMV. All that means is that he'll be going to jail. I'm not driving. I told you that. I don't have a contract with the DMV. Please get your shift commander. All right. All right. Okay, so right now I'm waiting for I'm waiting for my shift commander. For their shift commander. That's what I'm waiting for. Sir. We tell you a couple of times to provide your license. I'm not driving. I'm not driving. I All told right. you that. I'm not driving. Right now, so, this is illegal what you're doing. Right. I'm going to tell you I'm charging time, you sir. a dollar We're gonna tell you for every time. second that you're detaining me, sir. Yeah. We, like every said, second that you're detaining me. All right. Take take your seatbelt and, st and step out of the vehicle, sir. I am not stepping if out of anything. Providing my Get your shift commander. Sir. Get your shift commander. Like I said, all right? Get your shift commander. Still give you're you threatening off. me. You're trying to intimidate me to provide a driver's license when I'm traveling. Now, what you're supposed to do is ask me for proof of identification. You haven't you did see, so. You, you, boss, traveling and driving the vehicle is, is the same thing. It is not the same thing. I'm an indigenous to this land. I have the right to travel from point A to point B. I'm so glad the officer just said that to him. Because this man is absolutely insane. He's under the belief that driving and traveling are two different things. These people are so lost, it's not even funny. You're threatening me. You're trying to intimidate me to provide a driver's license when I'm traveling. Now, what you're supposed to do is ask me for proof of identification. You haven't you did so. You, you, boss. Traveling and driving the vehicle is, is the same thing. It is not the same thing. I'm an indigenous to this land. I have the right to travel from point A to point B. Wrong. I'm an indigenous to this land. I have the right to travel from point A to point B. There's no crime that was committed. There's no injured party. There's no injured party. And then we have this other detective over here circling the vehicle. Do not reach your hand in this vehicle because I'm telling you, I will put a lien on your bond. Okay. Okay. You're trying to intimidate me to do something I don't have to do. Sir, one more time. You need to provide your license. I'm not driving. Of the vehicle. I'm not driving. You're not driving? I'm not driving. I'm traveling. You got identification, boss? I have I have my Moorish American national ID, yes. Can, I, can, can you give it to me? Yeah, you can have that. So, unfortunately for him, he's clearly about to go to jail because the ID that he has is a Moorish American national ID, and unfortunately for him, that is not a driver's license. So, this guy is clearly about to go to jail. You got identification, boss? I have, I have my Moorish American national ID, yes. Uh, can, can you give it to me? Yeah, you can have that. I'm an American national. 
What paperwork? I don't have to provide that. I don't have to provide that. I'm not a member of your society. This is a private vessel. Well, you still need to provide... This is, I don't have to provide anything. I just was nice by giving you that. I didn't have to give you that. Now, please get your shift commander. Get your shift commander, please. And we're going live on this, too. I'm going to put a lien on your bonds. Okay. Every second that I'm here, I'm charging you a dollar for me being detained. Okay, what, what, are you, what are you looking for? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Can you please identify yourself? Officer Malavit. What's your badge number and what's your nationality? 1181. What's your name? I don't have to tell you my nationality. So... <laughs> Officer Malavit. What's your badge number and what's your nationality? 1181. What's your name? I don't have to tell you my nationality. Yeah. So, so what are you doing here with the, the lights in my eyes? You can't, you don't, you, you're not going to tell me your nationality, but you can't bring your law to me then. You can't bring your law. What kind of nationality this, are you looking for, boy? For, for <laughs> the cop just asked him, what kind of nationality are you looking for? Exactly. Like, what, what do you, why do you need to know these people's nationality? That has nothing to do with this traffic stop. These more solvers are absolutely ridiculous. You're not going to tell me your nationality, but you can't bring your law to me then. You can't bring your law. What kind of nationality this, are you looking for, boy? For, 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 you're not going to tell me your nationality, but you can't bring your law to me then. You can't bring your law. What kind of nationality this, are you looking for, boy? For, first of all, if you're an American, you can't be because you forfeit that when you took an oath. Took an oath for what? To become a police officer. Okay, you're committing treason because you're enforcing corporate policy right now. You're not enforcing the law of the land, which is the Constitution. Okay, boss. Sir, you have a license, yes or no? And this is your, your name over here, boss? In the back of the car? That's my title. Jamal? Jamil. Jamil? Rasul Bey? That's correct. Right. I'm an American national. An American national. That's correct. Oh, yeah. I'm not a part of a member of your society. Mm -hmm. I'm being illegally detained. Going back to the to the reason of the car stop, all right? My lights uh, was the vehicle, off. The vehicle, sir, you're driving without lights, and also you don't have mirrors. On they the were stolen side. today. I filed right. the report. They were stolen today. I filed the report. Right. My mechanic is not uh, available for the weekend. I have to wait until Monday. All right, that's perfect, all right? So, like I said, you're still driving with... I'm not without driving. Without. You keep saying I'm driving. I keep telling you I am traveling. Uh, you're traveling. So you're traveling without the light. Okay, that's not a crime. It's an infraction, sir. That's not a crime. It's an infraction. That's not a crime. That's not a crime. You're, you're that, no, I don't. That's not a crime. Get your shift commander. You're still trying to intimidate me to provide something I don't have to. I am not driving. Get your shift commander. You pulled me over because my lights were out. Okay, I'll turn them on. They know what they're doing is wrong and it's illegal. They're enforcing corporate policy right now. I already told them I'm an American national. Get me your shift commander. I'm not arguing. What I'm doing is asserting my rights. 
my indigenous rights to this land. This is my land. What's going on here? Where's the shift commander? Hmm? I got three patrol cars on me. They still denying to give me the shift commander. I, what, what was your name again? Officer Ramirez. Officer Ramirez. Is your shift commander on his way? Sir, you're not going to provide the... I told you I'm not driving. And you're still trying to intimidate me and use TDC to, for me to provide you something I don't have to provide you with. That's TDC, threat, duress, and corrosion. You're trying to intimidate me and you have weapons on your on your waist. Officer Detective Ramirez, you know what you're doing is wrong. You know it. I just told you I'm not driving and you're still detaining me. But you guys will receive some paperwork. Trust me. You will. Every second at your own risk. Do you guys have a warrant? Hmm? You guys have a warrant signed by a federal judge? If not, why am I here? Hmm? Okay. I'm going to be quiet too now. So I am still here Being illegally detained I told these guys that I wasn't driving I'm traveling And they're still detaining me I asked for their shift commander And they're refusing They're trying to conduct business with me But they're doing it wrongly There's no There's no there's no injured party. Hmm? Where's the injured party at? So, Officer R Detective Ramirez, you're from the Caribbean, you said, huh? So how can you bring your law to America? You're acting as a tax informant agent for the IRS right now. That's what you're doing. Committing treason. Detaining me from traveling. I'm an indigenous to this land. It's my God-given right to travel. Without being infringed. The things these more sovereigns say while detained at these traffic stops is absolutely ridiculous and it never, ever works. Any individual looking to join this Morris group in the future, do not 
do it. You'll be wasting your time. You'll be wasting your money because they're going to tell you to purchase a nationality card from one of the Morris publications. The card is a piece of junk. Do not waste your time. Do not waste your money. The arguments never, ever work. Hey, let's go, let's go.